It's a piece about melancholy. It references a Five Mile Iron Age Dyke in Oxfordshire. It refers to the iconic Ditchley portrait of Queen Elizabeth I, painted by a Dutch painter, Marcus Gerhardt the Younger. Ditchley literally meaning, in this case, a woodland clearing on Grimm's Ditch, which is the location of the piece, where we find both the singer and the dancers. It's a sort of melancholic world where a person of power, not necessarily Queen Elizabeth I, it could be any person of power, a politician or leader, is expressing that although they are powerful, although they are praised, they ultimately feel incredibly depressed and cannot shake this feeling. There is a sonnet on the painting, and then there are three Latin inscriptions. She gives and does not expect. She can but does not take revenge. And in giving back, she increases. This harks back to David and Saul and lots of other instances where someone of power is being soothed by music. And the lamenting protagonist of this short monodrama could be any other person of power, but someone in a state of depression who requires music to see sense of what's around them. The singer and the ensemble sometimes evoke the melancholic airs of Huygens and Dowland and this music of that era, while at other times they join the dancers in a sort of dark and energetic climate. person in a position of power is seeing the dancers in front of her, reminiscing on times before, but also seeing a darkness in that dance he or she hasn't seen before. The reason I was particularly interested in this painting is because at some point it's been cut down along the right-hand edge. And the last few letters or words of each line of the poem has been lost to history along with part of the painting. I liked the idea that this represented what it is like for someone trying to convey that state of depression, how it might come across and how it might be lost in translation. The piece is also about that translation of an idea, of a feeling, music's ability to convey emotion, and a poem or a text's ability to convey meaning or expression throughout time. <laughs> 